is a band that's very heavy metal, Ancient Creation. You guys want to go ahead and introduce yourselves? I'm Steve, uh, lead vocals. Mike, drums. Jason, guitars. Andy, bass. Peter, guitar. All right, now how'd you guys come together? Oh, it was a random meet. <laughs> I've known Mike for many years now, and uh, he was jamming with these guys, and we just kind of hooked up, and Peter actually put the band together, so he could probably tell you more. It just started off as a, probably late 2003. Uh, I've known Andy and Jason forever, and we just started doing some recordings, and uh, we didn't really know if it was going to go any further than that, but uh, started to come together. We put an ad out and found Mike, and then it started to really feel like it was becoming a band. And then uh, we found Steve, and then it just clicked, and uh, that's where we're at now. What's your guys' favorite part about making music and you know making records, stuff like that, doing shows? What do you guys like the most about it? Oh man, it's a wide variety. Yeah. For me, it's getting rid of the uh, the energy. It's a great thing about playing the drums, no matter how frustrating life is or what's going on. You can always take it out of your drums. Yeah. So you know, and Spoken then get, like a true drummer. you better believe it. And then to get out there and uh, have people appreciate it, you know, it's just it's better than any drug. It's still with the rush that it gives you. The creativity of it all. Yep. How about performing? What's your guys' favorite part of performing? Just same deal, just kind of getting it all out there? Oh, yeah, just the live feel of, you know, getting everybody into it and, and just having a good time, period. Is there, like, one moment from one of your shows that sticks out that you guys could tell the viewers? Something that crazy, that something wild. Mike streaked across the stage. <laughs> or that, that hasn't happened yet, that's right. That's, that's a secret. You keep pushing for it. Um, oh, I don't know. I don't There's know if we've been had something. anything too wacky happen to us or anything weird, but just those shows where everyone's going crazy as far as wanting a particular song of ours, you know, just yelling for a particular song or getting mad at us if they find out we're not going to play it. Um, but just, you know, all the hard work when, when you create songs and um, to have other people really get into those songs that you worked so hard to, uh, to put together. And just so when your own creation's out there, you're not doing a cover tune, and it's your own thing, and people are getting into it, that's that's what I find really satisfying. Now, how would you guys, uh, what, what would you guys say that some of your influences to get to where you are today are? You, you start at the very beginning, you know, with your Black Sabbath and your Iron Maiden and your Judas Priest, and uh, it, it seemed like, um, kind of like somewhere in the 80s, heavy metal kind of really started to be its own thing and not just this sort of hybrid of blues and you know acid rock or you know that kind of thing and uh that's kind of where metal was in its purest form that's most of the stuff that we've been listening to it's like like metal church and trouble and candle mass and stuff that is you know kind of no frills as far as uh style is just kind of the pure uh you know old doomy sounding you know evil sounding stuff yeah all right, well, what uh, then how would you guys, you know, explain what your music sounds like? That's the hard part. Everybody calls us power metal, but we don't really fit into that genre because we don't really do the, the, the mystical dragons type of thing. <laughs> We're not stuff. really in the happy major keys most of the time, so we've, we've earned the label dark power metal, which I think I'm kind of happy with if we had to uh, give the, the thing we do a label. But uh, for me, it's just metal when it comes down to it, what, you know, what Andy said, Iron Maiden, Judas Priest, and Black Sabbath. That was just considered metal. There was no subgenre of that at the time, so we just call ourselves pure metal. If you had to <laughs> call you it go. anything, I guess.